As millions travel over the next few days, and with even more holiday travel around the corner, health experts are keeping a close eye on a new strain of the flu, which they say could mean we are in for a rough flu season. A new flu strain is raising alarm as winter approaches. Scientists are tracking the H3N2 subclade K variant. Because we, as a community, don't have as much immunity to it, more people are getting sick. The new variant is genetically different from the strain in this year's flu vaccine, so it could escape immunity even for people who got their flu shot. That could lead to increased spreading, according to infectious disease epidemiologist Catherine Troisi. This strain so far does not seem to cause more serious disease, more um, hospitalizations. However, if you have more people getting sick, then there are going to be more hospitalizations. Subclade K was first spotted late in the flu season for the Southern Hemisphere. In the CDC's most recent data, the K subclade made up 56% of all H3N2 flu cases, which account for the bulk of people infected. The fact that we're seeing more H3N2 overall means we're probably in for a rougher season. Another concern, fewer people are getting their flu vaccine. More than 2 million fewer shots were given at U.S. pharmacies through October compared to last year. That's according to health information and research company IQVIA. Fewer people getting the vaccine means that there are going to be higher rates of flu infection uh, because fewer people are going to be protected. The CDC recommends nearly everyone six months and older should get the flu vaccine, saying it is the best way to reduce the risk of getting sick. Another virus health experts are watching is norovirus. According to the latest CDC data, positive tests for that virus have doubled over the past three months. There's no vaccine for it, but doctors recommend washing your hands thoroughly and frequently to prevent it. Stephanie Lieberg, Scripps News Group, Washington.